Albuquerque's animal welfare gets so many complaints about barking dogs and other noisy pets, they had to change the way they respond to those calls. And they say so far, it's working. News 13's Annalisa Pardo is live from home to explain. Just the new system requires a written log documenting how disruptive the pet is. Animal welfare says it's helped weed out some false reports. And sometimes these aren't actually legit complaints. Sometimes it's just to get on each other. And so with this new system is actually helping us showing that the caller as also has to take charge and help us. Received a noise complaint. If the owner doesn't fix the issue within 10 days, animal welfare will then send the complainant a noise log, which they are supposed to fill out every time the animal is noisy and for how long. Since the new system went into effect, Lieutenant Romero says animal welfare has received about 10 logs. One of those logs coming from a Ventana Ranch neighborhood. Now the owner of the dogs at this home has to go to court. We spoke with one of his neighbors who says he's been dealing with the barking for years. He's got five very large dogs. They're all over 100 pounds. So when they get going, it's a lot of noise. Lieutenant Romero says the consequences vary by case and are ultimately up to a judge, but an animal welfare officer will often be asked to suggest a solution. Romero says they typically suggest pet school, but it can also land you a $500 fine or up to 90 days in jail, but they rarely suggest removing the pet. Back to you. All right, thank you, Annalisa. Romero says dogs are not the only pets that they receive noise complaints about. He says right now they're dealing with a case involving roosters.